different scenes that we're talking about now. So we moved to a new scene. We're at Riverside and Clipper Way. And the reason we're here is that if you go all the way back to 245 this morning, Sacramento police say they responded here where you see that black car with the flashers on uh, to the report of a shooting victim. It was here. They found an adult male uh, shooting victim that was rushed to the hospital. Unfortunately, Sacramento police say that male victim has passed away. So that's the scene here at Riverside and Clipper as all lanes of traffic uh, at this spot remain shut down. But now take a look at this video because this is where we started our day over at the Colony House apartment because Sacramento police confirm the shooting actually uh, traces back to this apartment complex and the shooting happened at this apartment complex. So that is why you've got two different investigative scenes right now at the apartment. They're processing where the shooting took place and then where we are right now, they're processing where the victim was ultimately located. Now, if we come back out here live uh, at this point in time, Sacramento police say they have no known suspects. They have, uh, in their words, talked to everyone at that apartment complex and that the suspect is quote not there so uh, right now they are asking for anybody with information to uh, contact the Sacramento Police Department if they know something about this shooting but uh, the second part of all of this is the impact on the morning commute here in the pocket area especially along Riverside Boulevard where we are uh, both east and westbound lanes are shut down here at Clipper Way and then outside the apartment complex you can't go uh, you can't access I-5 eastbound uh, there at Jomfer because that is uh, shut down due to that investigative scene. So it remains an active investigative scene here along Riverside Boulevard. We continue to try and get uh, more information, but at this point in time, one person dead and a suspect or suspects still being sought by Sacramento police. Live here in Sacramento, Mike Tassel, KCRA 3 News.